Hot Diggity Dog. Easiest thing to throw on the barbecue during the summer is a hot dog. I'm going to take the humble hot dog and elevate it to a gourmet status. Today we're making three delicious gourmet hot dogs. We're going to start with the Thai red curry hot dog, followed by a nacho dog, and I'm going to finish it off with a shawarma dog. Each one of these recipes, they're simple and delicious, and your friends and family are going to love them. Before I go any further with these recipes, Please make sure you subscribe to my channel. I upload a ton of videos every week, so make sure that you're subscribed. Also, ring the bell, that's YouTube's new bell icon. That will notify you every time I upload a new video. Now, let's get cooking. Let's start with a quick Thai red curry sauce that will need some time to thicken. This is super simple. I'm adding one tablespoon of red curry paste, this is just a quick store-bought one that I find works really well. I'm going to follow this with two tablespoons of coconut cream. I buy this canned and it's way thicker than coconut milk that you would use if you were making a curry. Literally just mix this together, allow it to heat up and come to a boil and then take it off the heat. I'm also going to prepare a quick tahini sauce that is two tablespoons of sour cream and two tablespoons of tahini paste. Just mix this well together. I have some regular chicken franks here. You can use hot dog wieners if you want, but I've chosen the larger franks for my gourmet experience. You can also use turkey, beef, or pork sausage. I'm going to very lightly score these franks. Now this is going to give me more surface area to grill, but also when the meat cooks on the grill, the slits will open up, leaving more crevices for the toppings. My grill is now hot and ready to go and on go my chicken franks. Depending on the protein that you use and the temperature of your grill, this is going to take anywhere from 5 to 7 minutes. While my franks cook and blister, my dad is patiently getting some sun and waiting for his lunch. Keep rotating the franks. As you can see, the slits start to pull away and these crevices are going to hold a lot more of those toppings and it's also going to cook the sausage faster. These are ready to come off the grill now. Next, I'm going to work on the hot dog buns. I'm using mini baguettes, also known as bagatinis, and I got these at my local grocery store. You can use these as is, or you can toast them slightly. Instead of slitting them horizontally like a humble hot dog bun, I'm going to slice them straight through the top. Now for the fun part, the Thai red curry dog. Grab a franc and insert it into the mini baguette cavity. Drizzle it with the Thai red curry sauce. It has cooled down a bit and has thickened. For some crunch, I'm going to use some mama noodles. These Thai noodles can be eaten straight out of the bag as they are pre-cooked. I'm going to top this with some caramelized shallot rings, some gorgeous Thai basil, and fresh coriander. Next, we're going to all lay it up with my nacho dog. Grab a franc and insert it into the cavity and stuff it with shredded cheese. I'm just using a Tex-Mex blend. Add as many jalapenos as you dare or leave them out if you don't want it too spicy. And I'm also going to add some blue corn tortilla chips. What are nachos without these? Just stick this in the oven for a few minutes until the cheese gets nice and melty. Then remove it and top it with some salsa and sour cream. This is a huge hit with the kids. And finally, one of my faves, the shawarma dog. Grab a franc and insert it into the bagatini. Get some of that tahini paste in here. And 
Then I'm also going to add some pickled turnips. You can get these at most Middle Eastern stores. I'm also going to add some shallot rings and some fresh parsley. have it three ways to take your humble hot dog and make it extra gourmet special thank you so much for joining me on craving food adventures i hope you enjoyed these three delicious recipes i know you're going to try them and your family and friends are going to love them if you want more recipes like this do let me know and i can make another video before the summer comes to an end make sure you subscribe to my channel guys i upload a ton of videos every week share my channel and my videos with your family and friends and ring the bell, that's YouTube's new bell icon that will notify you every time I upload a new video. And the fun doesn't stop there. Make sure you're following me on all of my social channels. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and even Snapchat. Until I see you next time, take care, happy eating, bye.